Hey guys, on today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to update your pro video formats to 2.0.7. Now, this is in the new Mac OS. You guys will see right up here on the Apple logo. And this goes with every other OS as well. The Apple logo, you guys will see your App Store plus your system preferences. Now, if you guys are in High Sierra or Sierra, this update will be under your App Store, right? So you guys will click on this. But if you guys are in the newest Mac OS, then that update is actually in system preferences. So that's new. In any other OS out there from before, it was only under the App Store. But now, everything that has to do with your software in your Mac has moved here. Any other apps such as Final Cut Pro or any other ones that have to do with your Mac, those will be under the App Store. But updates like this, software-wise, for your Mac will be here. Anyways, right here is where you guys will see this option to update now. Now, what I suggest doing before you guys do this is never having this on. So do not have a check mark under automatic keep my Mac up to date because that can create huge problems. Just because if this updates by itself and you guys don't know about it, then you guys won't know why your Mac is acting up. But if you guys do the update and then see that something happened, then you guys know exactly what's going on with your Mac. Anyways, this shouldn't really screw up with your Mac because again, this is all the formats that you guys are updating and that's it. It's not a huge update. You guys can actually click on install right now. Okay, it's only six megabytes. That means it's gonna take a couple of seconds, not even minutes, but seconds to just make the update and actually install the update. So what we're gonna do is click on update now and you guys will see that this will be done pretty fast. All it says about a minute. It should take a little bit less than that. Plus installation time, it's just seconds. Before you guys do this, it's good to just have a, a good backup using Time Machine. Time Machine is something pre-installed on your Mac and it's free. All right guys, so right now our Mac is up to date and that's it. As you guys could see, it only took a couple seconds to make this update. It's always good to keep our pro video formats up to date. Now, you guys see this website that I showed you? This is not from where you guys would do it normally. If you must, then this would be it. But if you guys are having problems, just sign out and sign back into your app store. And uh, if you're in High Sierra, for example, or right here, well, this you guys shouldn't really have a problem. If you guys click on Advanced, for example, you guys will see this. So just make sure not to have, again, do not have install macOS updates like right away or automatically do anything else. Now, automatically download new updates when available? Sure, as long as they don't get installed, all right? Um, now, if you guys have slow internet, they might as well take that off. Okay, so I'm gonna unlock this thing and take that off because maybe you guys don't want it to download while you're doing something and you're wondering why is my internet kind of slow? So you guys might want to take that off. For me, I'm gonna leave it on because I wanted to download, but not actually install the update. Anyways, that's it for this video tutorial. If you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.